What's he doing? Il est devenu fou Fils le camp They let you come and go as you please. I thought the fortress was closed to all. Aye, but William wishes to have repairs completed as soon as possible. It's been to our advantage. The perfect cover. It's clever. Anyway, I've finished my report and should deliver it. For once, it seems things might go our way. And not by accident. Well, the Bible does say God helps those who help themselves. Nah, it doesn't, actually. That's from one of Aesop's fables. The Bible says quite the opposite, in fact. Many passages of being patient and faithful are waiting for the Lord to decide if he wishes to assist. Well, I say we've waited long enough. You'll hear no argument from me. Very well. I'm off then. Bother someone else. It's him we should follow. It's him will lead us to victory. Stand up, friends. Do not allow yourselves to be sent to slaughter based on the whims and wishes of an uncertain king. We must rely on men who are stronger in their convictions. Men like William of Montferrat. pieces on me. Take them. Take them and go. It's not gold I seek, but information. I know nothing. You know William. Tell me how to reach him. It's impossible. He meets at the king. And when will the king be gone? Today. But it won't help you. They're sure to argue. And then William will retire to lecture the soldiers. So it always goes. Richard berates William. William berates his men. He won't see you. I already told you. I need to see William. I never said he needs to see me. Then our business is done. Not yet, I'm afraid. There's one last thing I need from you. What is it? Your life. <laughs> Altair, always in need of a hand to do your dirty work. This time, 
Al Muelim did not order anything. It is just for my own pleasure that I ask you to find some Masia flags I've hidden in Richard's district. Since I am a loyal assassin unlike others, I will tell you what people are saying in Akka. It is important information. But this time, try to come back to me faster than the first time. I won't help you. Your hard work is changing my opinion of you. Here is what I know about William of Montferrat. He and Richard had a disagreement before the king left for Jaffa. Since then, William stays in his citadel, surrounded by his army. Do you have what it takes to attack him in this protected environment? We'll see, but I am still doubtful. Safety and peace, brother. Although it seems I'll be receiving neither. Serves me right, I suppose. Got a bit careless, and now William sent his bowmen after me. I deal with them myself, but to be honest, I lack the skill. Would you be willing to seek them out and kill them? I, I might have something useful for you, were you to accept. But be careful not to let them see you. came in peace to the Holy Land to spread the message of our Lord that they turned away. They no reason to stand to accept here. him Please. as their savior. These men hold evil in their hearts. Why would anyone and want to do so that? Blessed Richard, King and Savior, now stands against them, defending us from their wicked ways. Be not afraid. Fear and doubt are the weapons of our enemies. Do not listen to their lies. Poisonous words ha! also the fruits of confusion. If you find yourself tempted, go and pray. Doing that. A few coins, all I ask for is a few coins. Thank you, Antaeus. 
I can once more move freely through the city. In exchange for your aid, take this map I prepared. It shows where William has stationed his other archers. Most useful should you find yourself inside his fortress. Let me rear for a moment, Altair. William of Montferrat has replaced many of the district's honest merchants with men loyal to his cause. He seeks to weaken faith in King Richard by overcharging honest citizens for poorly crafted goods. These corrupt merchants must be removed. Find their stands and destroy them. Please, sir, have any money? <laughs> What have I done wrong? They should be all right then! Now! <coughs> done for! Just give up! <coughs> 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 It may seem a small thing you've done today, but it's important nonetheless. This bit of paper should prove useful when you finally face William. Altair. He scared me. Richard's men are after me. Two of them, to be exact. I was trying to strike a deal with them, but I realized that they were toying with me, so I ran away. You shall be the angel of death and collect their heads before they collect mine. When it is done, I shall tell you of the deal. I don't understand what he's trying to accomplish. <laughs> You've no reason to be here. Leave now.
He must not be of sound mind. What a relief it is to know that I am safe. Thank you, Master. I tried to make a deal with the Citadel guards to leave the gates open, even when the alarm sounds. I failed you. So now, your only escape from Richard's Citadel will be to climb the fortress walls. Forgive me. Altair, what brings you back so soon? I've done as asked and armed myself with knowledge. Speak, and I will judge. William's host is large and many men call him master, but he's not without enemies. He and King Richard do not see eye to eye. It's true, they've never been close. This works to my advantage. Richard's visit has upset him. Once the king has left, William will retreat into his fortress to brood. He'll be distracted. That's when I will strike. You're sure of this? As sure as I can be. And if things change, I'll adapt. Then I give you leave to go. End the life of Montferrat that we may call this city free. I'll return when the deed's been done. Fast forward in memory to a more recent one. 